happy Saturday you guys so the time has finally come we're gonna be cleaning out our messy garage I know you guys have heard me talk about this a lot I'm already turn it off right now hurry up We're about to clean out this garage. I'm about to move the car out and just begin to go through things, throw stuff out, organize things so that we can get our stuff out of storage and get rid of that bill. Um, so yeah, I've already showed you guys. I don't know if you guys remember, but look, it's a hot mess, okay? It's really, 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 really a big old mess. I mean, stuff everywhere. I got Amari helping. Michaela's on the other side running from the camera because she feels like <laughs> she don't want you guys to see her. She feels like she's not cute. But, you know, my garage is just out of control. So we're going to handle this today, get organized, and get it together. Getting out the way for the camera. Babe is trying to make sure everything is orchestrated right, everything is going properly. I'm throwing a lot of his stuff away because he's not here to get it. They gotta go. He said, I, was, I threw away some Jordans and he said, Get them out of there. So basically, what goes around comes around. Oh, yeah. Well, come do something about it then. Hopefully, she don't. She put this in a video. She Alright, you guys, so we're finally done. You can see that everything is organized everything that went in the trash is in the trash took everything to the dump cleared out a whole lot of space in here so once we bring everything we will rearrange this stuff over here because we have the we have the big racks from costco we have two of those big racks from costco in our storage so one will go on this wall and then another one will go on this wall all of this stuff right here will be moved over to this area and all of these bins will be moved onto the racks that's in storage because everything all of the bins that are right here right now they are um actually they came from the rack from the storage so i had been back and forth to the storage bringing stuff because i had a lot of christmas stuff and just random stuff that we wanted here so pretty much the the racks are empty somewhat so all of that will be on the racks and then that'll free up space over in that area for this stuff and then a lot of stuff that's in the garage is like my mom's old um bedroom furniture i think i have my old bedroom furniture i have like um a couple of other pieces of furniture in there that i'm gonna keep but all that other stuff i'm gonna get rid of and just keep what's important so the job is still not done but this was step one clearing this out getting rid of what i've accumulated because that's 
part of my fault. Well, mostly my fault, because I'd be bringing stuff home, collecting stuff for no reason, okay? But anyways, you guys get the picture, and um, I'm so happy my kids was here to help me. Maya was like, oh, mom, I'm so happy I had to work today. I'm like, oh, don't worry, because it's not over. We still got to move some of this stuff in so from the from the store so we're all done i'm gonna park the car on this side so everything else from all over here will be like more storage space to put stuff once we get everything hopefully i won't need a whole lot of stuff because i want to say my storage is about the size of this one side of the garage so once everything is all situated and everything is out that we don't want it'll be a-okay so i'm gonna go take a shower now because um michaela's gotta go do some makeup for a friend of mine and because today is prom um for her so it is um almost three o'clock it should be time to go pick up maya from work because she gets off at three it was like 2 40 something a minute ago so i'm pretty sure it's three o'clock now pick her up come back get a shower and then get ready to head over there because we need to be there by like five o'clock so she can work on her makeup get that all done and just a long day and did i tell you guys that i had to get up early like five o'clock this morning and drive omari over to um get his haircut like 30 minutes away his appointment was at 6 15 so i had to do that so i'm about tired already I'm looking forward for this day to be over with or just, you know, wind, wind down because I'm tired. Back in the house, you guys. Just picked up Maya and let me tell you, I've been trying to stay away from like sweets and stuff like that. Lately, I've been eating a lot of cookies, especially when I was on the road. And Maya, you know, she works at Panera and she brought home some lemon drop cookies you guys they are so good i don't know if i told you guys about the um i think it's called kitchen sink i think it's called the kitchen sink cookies over at panera those are really good but they're like 800 calories i believe for one cookie and one cookie was like literally four dollars so or for something very very expensive and she brought us home a little treat some um iced coffee so i know i've been doing my little clean eating but today i'm treating myself you guys the apple cider vinegar i told you will give you energy and it does suppress your appetite like for real i can go all day and not get hungry um it really 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 works so i haven't like measured my waist or anything like that because a lot of people measure their waist i didn't do that but i probably will um today or tomorrow just to kind of see from here on out what it does but i do feel like i'm not bloated so get you some apple cider vinegar take it with the turmeric so you can get some energy and suppress that appetite because it really does work oh look at these lights they're so orange and yellow i'm in my bathroom i'm getting ready to take oh, i don't want that in here that way Get ready to take a shower. And like I said, we got to start getting ready to head out. Amari said he doesn't want to go. I said, that's fine. But you still better take a shower because he be trying to go get on his game and then play like he even forgot to take a shower. I'm not playing that. That's that little boy. Hey, guys. I'm on my way to the girl's house. So Michaela can do her makeup. Thank you, Michaela, for helping out today. Her and Amari did so good. I was so happy they helped me. Like, oh my God, very, very happy. They didn't want to come with us. We were, I was gonna bring Maya um, and Amari, but they didn't want to come. Maya just got off work, she's tired. Amari want to play his game because he cannot play that game during the week. So that boy takes advantage on the weekends. And, um, yeah, so we're just gonna go head over here and I'll be there in about another 15 minutes. It's 4.40 right now. And um, get her done because I think she'll be leaving, I think by six, I'm not sure. But anyways, I'll um, try to see, you know, after her makeup is done and she wants to um, let you guys see how it came out and I'll show you guys. Um, how she looks. 
but yeah the fun funny thing is she just told her mom the day before yesterday she wanted to go to prom like her mom had bought her a dress and it's her junior prom and um the the girls um the girl you know i had wanted to go to prom she was kind of back and forth about it her mom bought her a dress and then she last minute said i'm not going but then the day before yesterday you guys she came to her mom and was like i want to go to prom now so um you know she's like oh my god i could hurt her but she's getting it together everything is coming together nicely and um i know she's gonna look so pretty when she's all together and um like i said mama's knows how to pull it together at last minute with nothing will make it work so i'm excited to see how everything turns out for her and i'm excited that she's going to prom even though my child that one right there says she don't want to go to prom so i just know she better not wait no two days before prom talking about she want to go to prom because next week is her prom so and she don't have a dress or nothing so she better not pull that stunt but anyways we'll be here shortly it's a really nice day today you guys it is so warm it's 86 degrees it says out here and there's a nice like breeze a beautiful breeze it feels so good so it would be nice if i could just go by the pool and just relax but i don't want to be with all that pollen they got to clean that that up first because when we went the other day it was like pollen all over the place like thick pollen so we'll see today is just a gorgeous day perfect day for prom by the way there's the prom girl Getting that face done. <laughs> she already got one eyebrow done. Michaela's working on the other one. So you guys, this is her before and we will show you her after when she's <laughs> done. She don't need no makeup anyway. Look at that pretty smile. Oh yes. Look at that brow. I be trying to get mine to look like everything. I wish I could. I said, I said both. I did it. Oh, oh Juicy got a white collar? I think that's actually by Urban. They can say. Hey, y'all, what time? Daddy said, what time y'all trying to get down? What time is it? Michaela, you don't want to do this? Oh, cool. Look at everybody. You Look. Can send me some pictures. <laughs> <laughs> yep, there you go. There you go. Oh, yeah. that is sweet. I need all, yeah. yes, I need all pictures. Put your, put your hand on that shoulder. Yeah, yeah, don't scared, be scared to touch it. Here you go. Who you dressed down on that? Yes, sir. She gives an attitude today. That's that red lip. So we're back home you guys and I am so happy this day is over with. I've been up since 5 o'clock this morning driving down streets. I mean I'm just tired. I'm so happy um, I can final, finally relax. So I'm about to take my dress off, put my pajamas on, something comfortable and go downstairs and watch a movie and um, call it a night. So I'm glad I was able to uh, film the, the girl who went to prom my friend's daughter she looks so so pretty um just absolutely beautiful and her um he's not her boyfriend but the guy that went to prom with her um he was handsome everything just turned out really nice her mom was so stressed out because it was like last minute like i said she had her dress but didn't have everything else to go along with it so now she could breathe they are off i just pray they have a good time be safe and enjoy prom i was asking michaela i'm like girl you don't want to do this and she's like no mom no so can't force her i'm not gonna force her i just hope she don't regret it later on in life and think back like i should have went to my prom but some people 
aren't into things like that. So I think Michaela is one of them. She's like a loner almost. But anyways, you guys, um, thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Oh, I'm so happy that the garage is clean. That is like a load off of my back. Um, it just, I feel so relieved that that part is done. So now the next step is getting the stuff out of storage and um, hopefully finding people who need furniture and that they would be willing to come pick it up and get it off of our hands because I just want to bring what's necessary here not just a bunch of stuff that I'm never going to use again so anyways you guys thank you so much for um watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're not subscribed to life of London also you guys don't forget to go over to a natural dose of London and um subscribe over at that channel too um because I'll be doing you know like girl things over there hair makeup some makeup I'm not a makeup guru but you know just girly things so yes yeah, subscribe over there but anyways you guys enough rambling I'm gonna get off of here do what I said and relax so I hope you guys had an amazing Saturday um and as always you guys I will see you guys in the next video bye guys